discussion has been very rich today and uh, it is clear that uh, there is a broad agreement on the important issues of labor markets today. Uh, I think uh, everybody agrees that the issue of uh, women employment is, is a major one in the region. Uh, we still have very low uh, labor force participation of women. There are lots of constraints to the employment of women. The overall conditions in the labor market are not favorable uh, to the employment of women. So that's one big issue. The second issue is the university graduates and the mismatch between the educated university graduates' uh, ambitions and uh, kind of uh, expectations and what the opportunities which are available by in the labor markets provide them, which are not consistent with their expectations. Uh, because the economy, the demand side of the economy, is not producing the kinds of jobs that they are looking for. And so, so we have a mismatch between the expectations of these university graduates and the reality of the labor markets, which is not providing these jobs. So that's the second one, second major issue that we have in the labor market. Now, how do you deal with that issue? That was the main topic that, you know, do labor market regulations play a role in resolving these issues? What kind of new uh, regulations can you put for, think about? How can you test them? How can you implement them? What are the opportunities to innovate? Do we have the capacity to innovate? Those are the issues that have been discussed today and then they open a whole set of new opportunities uh, for the researchers and for the era as well.